stick around. I'm going to talk about juice that you can't refuse. Hello fellow vapors, Vaping Newbie here, and tonight we're looking at some juices uh, from my great and good friends at G2K Vape and G2KVape.com and the website down below. You'll want to check them out. Folks, G2K, for my American cousins, does ship to the United States, so that might be extremely beneficial to you, um, given the Canadian dollar exchange with the American dollar, so on and so forth. I I'm not an economist. Uh, I went to visit my good friend Mario and ended up spending the day at G2K. I was spending the day at G... No, I won't do it. Uh, and they got in a whole batch of new juice lines, and uh, I hadn't been there in a while. So I took advantage of it. I brought my dripper, and I just tested the crap out of all of these new juices that they have, and some really, really good flavors. Uh, so we're going to be looking at three that were chosen today, and I'm surprised that Gianni and, Ma and Mario, Gianni is uh, another one of the owners of G2K. I'm surprised they still will talk to me, because I vaped a lot of juice that day, and, uh, but... Uh, I came away thinking, oh, if only I had the money, because I would have bought a lot more than I actually bought. Really some good flavors. And yeah, what do you call it? Spoiler alert. Yeah, I'm going to end up telling you I love them all, because I hand chose three, because I'm, I'm buying them. So I hand chose three that I wanted to do, and uh, not one of them disappointed. So uh, let's uh, get some tanks filled and start talking about some juice. Before I get in depth with the juices and start talking about them, uh, I do must mention that I do must mention I must mention that taste is subjective. What you like, I might not. What I like, you might not. We always keep that in mind. Uh, they are going to be uh, vaped on a variety of tanks, and there's something new that I do. I'll, I'll choose one and I'll drip it at the end. And um, at the same time, uh, different wattages, so on and so forth, and different uh, nicotine. Oh, I'm sorry, different uh, PGVG ratios, but all three milligrams of nicotine. So bear with me. Let me get the first juice out. The first juice uh, that we're going to be talking about today, um, you, you're going to see the name and then, then get the tie-in. Mafia Princess. I love me a Mafia Princess. Um, this is from a company called uh, Smacks Premium Juice. And what attracted me uh, was the packaging. And um, they put a picture up on Facebook and said, oh, i got to go see that. And it is a can, and it has a pump um, dispenser of the juice. And uh, it was kind of, it could be, could be depending on, on your, your tank or your clearmizer, your tank. Uh, it could be uh, an effort to get it in, but you might want to get one of these, uh, let me see if I got one handy here, one of these uh, needle nose bottles uh, for, I, I have some um, Lazarus Vintage in here right now. And you might want to get one of these bottles uh, to, to fill up in order to get in your tank. But if you're using it on a dripper, uh, I, I, I put it into a limo with absolutely no problem at all. And I top fill my limos. Yeah, I'm insane. So uh, I just thought it was an, an, an easier way. I had no issue at all. And I'll tell you, folks, I went through a lot of this juice while I was in the shop. It was just phenomenally good. Um, it's a company out of California. The packaging on the back, it has the ingredients, which aren't many. And then um, the nick level is, as you saw before, is on is on the cap. Um, really, really good juice. It is a 10% PG, 90% VG juice. So yes, it probably is tailored more for a dripper. But um, I always talk overviews in tanks because I think they are more common. So uh, just to keep it, you know, more even keel. I only use them in tanks. Uh, I tested it on dripper, but now I've been using it in tanks. And it's been no issue. Just really good flavor. This is a Limo at 1.13 ohms. I'm vaping it at 17.5 watts. I did try various wattages, and I found that that sort of 17 watt range was the nicest for this build. Really, really good. Um, when I was talking to Mario, he described it as like a tiramisu with espresso. Uh, I'm not a coffee holic, so uh, I don't get a lot of the espresso. 
And um, but I do get that sort of cakiness, and then the richness of the whipped cream is there. It yeah, the, the, for me the end is is sort of like a warm whipped cream, really really good. Uh, and and usually I try to keep the best for last, and I think I let off with the best in this case. Um, and, and as I mentioned, there, there wasn't a dog in these three. These are really good juices. Uh, the Smacks line uh, that I that I saw, as I recall, there were five different flavors, and all of them were good. Um, I want to touch on the premium e-juice. To me, premium e-juice is yes, you're going to pay a bit for packaging. This is this is twenty five dollars Canadian uh, for thirty milliliters, um, which might to some might seem a bit pricey, and you are paying a bit for the packaging. However, uh, the juice certainly warrants it. It is a very rich juice. It has that good flavor. And then to talk about premium meat juice, yeah, you can buy a premium meat juice, fifteen dollars, if it matches up quality-wise. Packaging is secondary; the quality-wise, obviously, is is primary. And so the quality of the sea juice is really, really good. And I think, again, it warrants that premium juice uh, uh, label. Just based on this, just based on this, go give G2K a look up. This juice is definitely worth it. Um, Chantal, I think you'd agree. Uh, and Mart, uh, my buddy Mart was with me that day in G2K, and he picked up some as well. So uh, the Smacks line is, is a very good line. My personal favorite was Mafia Princess. Like I said, I love me a Mafia Princess. This is just great juice. Let me change up the tank and get to the next one. The next juice uh, that we're going to be talking about uh, stays in the in the whole the whole theme of tonight, and this one's called gaudy and uh, it's a really good juice you know what i mean uh creme de la creme on the the bottle creme de la creme, uh, creme, de la creme. uh it's a vanilla vape now we switch lines so we, we look at the packaging the next two come from the same line it's a glass bottle with the uh it does have childproof safety cap it has the dripper type delivery system uh i kind of like the look of it it's got that gangster look but sorry not gangster they're like gangster uh, look to it, um, has the nicotine level, very easy to read. It says high VG, it does not have the PGVG ratio, I apologize for that, but it does say high VG, which, um, you know, again, is it made for dripper? Yes, but I put it in my Limo, my Limo is at 1.2 ohms, and I'm vaping it, I tried different wattages, I tried 20, and I find the taste is, it really came through a lot more in 18. It does have that vanilla cream to it or, 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 or custard. There is a cake flavor in behind it. Really, really nice. And again, so smooth. And, and that's the thing. I, I mean, these, these juices that I'm picking up at G2K, so very smooth. And, and I'm glad that they're focusing more on that aspect of it. Um, you don't lose the flavor with the high VG. And, and you know what? Uh, companies are getting so good at protecting their flavors, yet increasing the VG. Really, really nice. Uh, this has been steeping about two weeks now. Um, no, about a week, maybe just over a week now. And really, really nice. It's got that sort of gold color to it, and that'll, that'll just darken with a bit more time, and it'll probably just bring out the flavors more. Uh, but as it is right now, very, very good. So that's Gaudy from um, Creme de la Creme line from Mountain Oak Vapors, available G2K Vape. I kept telling Santino, Santino, you got to try the strawberry. Yeah, I'm having fun with it, but we're on the last juice, and uh, it shouldn't be silent. It is Omerta. And uh, it says on it, strawberry dolce, light uh I'm, I'm just, i don't speak italian uh I'm, I'm guessing light strawberry and it is a, a really creamy strawberry and uh on the website when you when you go with the g2k bait um they call it fluffy and, and i have to agree with that it's there's a, like almost like a strawberry whip really nice um if you follow at all uh, my videos, and, and, and I certainly hope you do, 
And when I talk about strawberries, I don't like strawberry the fruit. Uh, I like, you know, I don't even like strawberry jam. I, I, I eat raspberry jam, but in vape, the strawberry is, is one of my favorites. Now, Mario knows this because I buy a lot of uh, 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 strawberry uh, e-liquids off him. And uh, I'll, I'll tell you right now, Mario, and I hope you're watching, this is now uh, the number one. It's just really that phenomenal a juice uh, for me. For me, um, It has that lightness to it. It's not, again, in your face strawberry. It's more of a linger. It comes in as a, a strawberry whip. And uh, I really like it. So good job there. Uh, Mountain Oaks Vapors, uh, those, you know, the two that I've tried, and I've only tried the two from Mountain Oaks, they're definitely winners. And then, and then there's Mafia Princess from Smacks. That was uh, that day my favorite, now taken over by Omerta. So uh, really good juice. And this is important because you're in the States. They'll ship to the States. You're in Canada. Obviously, they'll ship within Canada. If you're in Montreal, you want to go visit them. Great, great group of guys. And again, these shops only sell authentic gear and, and getting higher and higher end e-juices, whether it be from Europe or the States or, you know, they have a house brand that's pretty damn good as well. So you, you can't discount that. Um, premium e-juice, definitely. Uh, you have to be a cut above the rest to become, in my books, a premium e-juice. And I think it's thrown around uh, too quickly. But in this case, these juices are certainly up to the task. So these are the juices I looked at today. Um, Smacks, uh, Mafia Princess, gotta have me a Mafia Princess. And then Mountain Oaks Vapors, I had Gaudi and Omerta. And Gaudi was a vanilla uh, vape or vanilla custard, if you will. I, I prefer it as a vanilla cream. <clears throat> really good, excuse me. And then Omerta was by far my, my favorite. Uh, I, I was vaping the two of them all day, uh, Omerta and um, Gaudi uh, interspersed. So uh, I, I was eating very able to tell or, or, or you know it was very easy for me to tell the difference between the two before I let you go though um, something new that I've been trying is I took uh, one of the juices and I put it into my uh, mutation uh, v3 mutation X sorry v3 and um, this is how I was introduced to this juice it's mafia princess um, by vaping it on the, uh, the, the mutation when I was at G2k vape And, you know, uh, well, <laughs> the flavor just pops. I mean, everything that I've heard about drippers, it's, it's true. The flavor just pops on it. It just, the, you know, this Mafia Princess really comes through. And good vape. I mean, 90% PG, or, sorry, 90% VG. Uh, I tried to blow it away and it comes back at me. Although, you get the scent. It's really nice. Really, really good juice. So, um, and I apologize for this because it usually blows away. Uh, so that's it for tonight. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. You know I like having you over. I like spending time with you. Uh, you got to check these juices out. Well worth it. Again, the links for G2K Vape and their Facebook page are down below. Go give them a look. And uh, definitely, if you're onto Facebook, give them a like. They are well worth it. And uh, that's how I was introduced to this by Facebook uh, them posting something. So. Stay healthy and happy vaping. Take care, folks.